golly gee willikers. Should I call her? Oh, horseradishes. I just don't know what to do. Yo, my man, Mortimer, do me a favor, son. Slide off your granny panties, grow some damn jungle hair under your armpits, man up, and call this female. Scattered thought? What are you doing here? I'm trying to help you get your groove started, you freaking dweebazoid. Okay, I'll call her. Just show me how you did that first. Alright, I got you, my dude. Let's get into it. Now, you're going to need a few things to get this done. You're going to need a tripod, you're going to need a green screen, and you're going to need some good studio lights. You want to record your subject on a green screen so that you can place them over your tablet or phone or whatever you're going to be using to have the hologram come out of. When you record your tablet or phone, you want to make sure that you get a good angle. You can get a better angle than what I got by kind of leveling it out a little bit so that your hologram stands up a little bit more and you can see a, a big difference between it standing and coming out of the tablet or the phone or computer, whatever you're going to use. Now, you want to go ahead and bring your footage of your phone or tablet into the top timeline and then you want to bring your footage of the subject in the green screen into the timeline below it. Now you want to double click on the green screen and you want to go to the picture in picture chroma key and click on crop and you want to go ahead and crop out pieces. As a matter of fact, let's go ahead and drag this forward a little bit to where we can see the subject in the shot so we know exactly how much we want to crop out of here. Alright, that looks good. So now we want to click on the chroma key tab. We want to apply the chroma key to it. Click OK. And now you can see in the preview that the subject is keyed out. So now we want to go to add another effect. We want to add new effect. And this time we're going to go to Studio HDRT Effects. And we're going to go to the Studio HDRT Effects, like I said, and go to Pan and Zoom. Go OK. And then we're going to go ahead and scale our subject to the correct scale that we want. And we're going to get him in the position horizontally and vertically how we want him to be. And let's try to move him down a little bit here. Right, now that we got them in position, we want to add another effect. We're going to go to RTFX Volume 1, and we're going to go to Radio Blur. The Radio Blur is kind of used just to make it look a little bit like just some distortion or some uh, electronic, I guess, fuzz or frequency coming through. If you want to, you can even add noise instead by going to RTFX, and then there's noise. Or you can put both of them in. I'll just put both of them in right now. Next thing we want to do is we want to add another effect. So we're going to go to the Red Giant Shine. Click OK. And we're going to change the ray length to 1. And we're going to change the color gradient. As a matter of fact, let's do this first. Let's go to Presets first. And we're going to change this to HD Shimmer Enlightenment. And then we'll go ahead and change the ray length to 1. And we'll change the transfer mode to overlay. And now you'll see he has kind of like a glow to him around him. And you got your hologram set up. Now, the one other thing that we do want to add into this is if we go to the chroma key, we want to go ahead and do the transparency as well. Because in order for it to look like a hologram, it's to look like you can see through them. So you go to about 50% where you can start seeing 
some of the numbers from the phone behind the individual and now you actually got a pretty good looking hologram of an individual that you can use for any of your videos. There you go, Mortimer. Now it's your turn, son. Call that female. Okay, I'm gonna call Griselda right now. Griselda? Yo, my man, change your plans. Take your phone, throw it in a wood chipper, and cut your hands off just in case you ever think about calling that girl again. I'm out.